Hello everybody, I'm Kelly from Earthly Delights and I'm a part-time eBay reseller. Welcome back to the channel and if this is your first time watching, thanks for joining us and thank you to those who have been watching all along. In this video, we're going to do an update of that Death Wish coffee mug collection that we recently purchased. We promised to do this to show you how much we're making on each of those mugs. If you haven't already, check out the three-part series on us you know, finding the mugs at a yard sale, that's part one. The second part is us going back and negotiating a price for those mugs. And then the third one is our unboxing video of those 43 mugs and the Death Wish swag. I'm gonna show you what's sold so far from that collection and what we listed it for. Did we get full price? Did we take a best offer? Let's dive right in. We've sold a total of six mugs so far. And I just have my phone here. I'm gonna go through all of the mugs that sold and what we got for each one. Uh, the first one is this 2015 white and red mug. And this is the mug that I actually saw at the yard sale that cued me in to, you know, maybe this couple had more of them. And so I asked them, hey, do you have more Death Wish mugs? Cause we're really interested in them. And they said, yeah, we happen to have 43 of them. We listed it for 85 and we got $85. So they paid full price for it. That was the first mug that sold in this collection. The next one is this rare 2015 shot glass. Now we had this listed for $300 and we just really were not sure how to price this, this shot glass. There weren't a lot of comps. There was also none out there that you could buy and so we decided to price it on the higher end and just see what offers would come in so we listed it for 300 we got an offer for 150 the guy really wanted it from Brooklyn New York and he was like listen this is the most I can pay for this this shot glass and so we went back and forth you know that's like that is 50% off and we counter offered at 175 and he decided to take it, so we sold that for $175. Uh, the next one is a 2016 Valentine's Day Devil Mug, and there were very few of these out there. We had it listed for $200, and we took a best offer of $170. Uh, the next one is this George Dethington Mug, and we had it listed for $250 and we took a best offer of $225. So we were happy with that sale. The next one is this 2015 Mardi Gras mug, uh, which was one of my personal favorites. And we had it listed for $350. There were none others listed. This is a rare mug and it sold for $350 for full price. The last one is this Stanley Thermos and there were none others listed, it's brand new. And so we listed it for 100 and we just took a best offer of $70. The total sales on those six mugs is $1,075 and eBay takes $107.50, which is 10%. So our profit is $967.50. Of course, we have to pay 15% taxes to that. Um, but just with six mugs, we nearly made a third of our money back. So we have, you know, a number of mugs left. They're all behind me here. And these are the ones that actually we haven't listed yet. We decided not to list everything at once because again, we didn't want to flood the market. Right now we have six mugs listed and two additional Death Wish items listed. And I just want to go through that and show you what, we're, what we've listed them for. Um, the first one is this Headless Horseman Halloween mug. This mug is one of the most expensive ones. We have it listed for $600 right now. We've gotten offers for $200. Um, there was an auction that just ran and it ended at $350, but then it actually got relisted. So I'm assuming that that person didn't pay and that they decided to relist that item for 500. So ours is at 600 right now. Halloween's coming up. So I'm assuming we're gonna get some activity on this mug. Uh, the next one is this uh, Valhalla Java Odin Force mug, and we have that listed for $120, and we have three watchers on that right now. We haven't gotten any offers on it. 
the next one is this uh, commuter traveler mug and it's listed for $350. It's from 2015. It's a rare mug and we have five watchers on that. We have sent some offers on it for I believe 300 um, but we haven't gotten any uh, interest yet in that but I'm sure it's going to go soon. The next one is this 2019 Frankenstein mug and we have that listed for $130 and we have five watchers on it right now and three interested buyers that we could send offers to. I believe we sent offers on this for like 115 but we haven't gotten any any bites yet so the next one is another one of my favorites. It is uh, the Raven Nevermore, and it's $130. We've got seven watchers on it, and um, we have sent some offers for $115, and we're just holding tight on that. There are quite a few of these listed, but it's such a cool mug. We, we want to get close to our asking price for it of $130. Um, the next listing that we have up is this Death Wish Clean Canteen and we have this listed for $70 and we have one watcher on it right now. And then we just recently listed this uh, Skeleton Coffee Scoop for $120 and one recently sold for $75 and I think that was brand new. So we'd be happy with $100. Um, but we have seen, we've seen comps where it's sold for 120 um, so we decided to list it for 120 and The last item is this Death Wish baseball hat, and it recently sold for $39, and we decided to go ahead and list that for $39. I think we had planned to list it for about $25. When we looked up comps again, we saw that it sold for a little bit more, so we decided to price it a little bit higher. Again, our total sales were $1,075. And right now we have listed $1,559 with those other six mugs. So we'll see what we get for those. And then we're also going to start, you know, slowly listing the rest of these. You know, I think in terms of listing the rest of them, I think we're still going to list them slowly and kind of wait for some of the others to sell before we roll out these. Um, you know, this is money sitting on our shelf. We do need to make that back so we can source more, but we also don't want to be hasty and list them and then take some lower offers. We don't want to get too impatient with it. For the 43 mugs and the swag, we spent $3,000. So we are a third of the way into making back our money. And so we'll keep doing these update videos to let you know how these mugs are doing and just, you know, was this a good investment? You know, we're still kind of in the thick of it and in the middle of it, but we really love these mugs and we like selling them. And, uh, you know, we hope they uh, make us our money back and also find good homes. Thanks so much for watching. If you haven't already, please hit that subscribe button. We release videos every week on sourcing and also what sold videos. And also hit that like button. Those things really help our channel grow. So until next time.